Oh, hey, kiddo. Everything all right? G go back to bed, honey. Daddy and I are a little busy, okay? You did it! You stopped your dad! You saved your mom, new kid! <laughs> That's right! And now there's nobody left to stop me! I'm off to another team, team, team! Connor, no! Who the hell are you? I'm the coon. This is your kid from the future. Our child from the future? Oh, God. I knew something like this would happen. Our child knows we've been lying and wants some answers. You're right, kiddo. We've been dishonest. But only because we wanted to protect you. The truth is, your mom and I have certain abilities. Powers that normal humans don't have. I discovered mine when I was younger. One day I created a Facebook profile, and within a few hours, I had over three million followers. My powers are similar, except they only seem to work on Instagram. I got four million followers as soon as I posted my first picture. Of course, powers like that don't go unnoticed for long. Shortly after that, your mother and I were kidnapped by the government where they had scientists spending months doing experiments on us, trying to figure out how we were able to gain so many followers so fast. That's where your dad and I met and fell in love. Inside a cold, damp government lab. Yes. By day, they ran experiments. And by night, we made sweet love. My powers combined with your mother's, you received over 10 million followers the minute you were born. And by the time they cut the umbilical cord, you were already more powerful than all the Kardashians combined. That's why we had to escape, because we knew the government would use you to do horrible things. And we've been on the run ever since, moving from city to city, always trying to stay one step ahead. But everywhere we go, you just can't seem to stop gaining followers. Sometimes they even break into our house and use our toilet just to be close to you. That's why we've been putting special medicine in your dinner, sweetie, to try to curb your powers. But it didn't work. The side effects of the medicine just gave you really powerful and really smelly farts. We're sorry, kiddo. Oh my god. I feel so relieved to have finally told the truth. Me too, honey. I... You know, I don't think I need to drink anymore. And I don't need to run from my problems with pop brownies. Oh, honey. I feel like our future is going to be totally different now. I believe in us. Oh, God, Barf. What about you, sweetie? Now that you know the truth, do... Do you think you can believe in yourself, too? back in downtown South Park. But where is everybody? More importantly, what period of time have we landed at? All right, let's get this thing started. Look, Butler. Today is a great day for South Park. This town has sucked for a long time, and finally Mitch Connor's gonna be sworn in as mayor. It is my honor to introduce Mitch Connor today, a man with some fucking balls Find the turf shit around! You did it, Butler! It's inauguration day! We can still stop Connor from becoming mayor! Let's do this! This way! 